In this video, I want to show you how you can record a narration file in Audacity and then embed that file into a Word document or into an Excel spreadsheet and play it back when viewing the, uh, the document. So the first thing I'm going to do is open Audacity and I'm going to record a simple file here. Testing, one, two, three. Testing, one, two, three. File, export audio to my desktop and I'll call it t123.mp3. Okay. And here is my file, T123. Now I'm going to open a Word document and I had a previous testing file in there. I deleted that. I'll save the document again and reopen it. Now there's no Word, there's no audio file in there. But if I want to put one in, I can click Insert and then go over to the right and there's this little uh, window icon. It's called an object. Click that and it brings up a selection pane. Now, MP3 files are not listed among the selections here, but you can create from file. I'll browse and on my desktop it was called T one two three dot mp3 so I'm going to open that don't click either one of these boxes just click OK and now it's embedded the file in this case right at the top of the the Word document so now I'm going to save the Word document close it and I'm actually going to get rid of T123 Delete that. And now if I open the Word document to show you that it's actually embedded, if I right click on the T123, you see a package shell object command here. Click activate contents and then click open. Testing one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. And it plays the file for you. So now you can do the same thing with Excel. I won't save that. I've got an Excel file here and I have another testing file. So let me open Excel. And let's say that I want to put the file right here in this cell. Click Insert. And again over on the right, oops, not getting over far enough, Insert. Click the same icon, create from file, browse, and in this case it's testing. And click OK. And now you can see the file is embedded here. I'm going to save the Excel workbook. And I'm going to delete my testing MP3. And I'm going to reopen the workbook. There's my link. Right click on it. Package show object. Activate contents. Open. Testing one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. So that's how you can embed these directly into your um, Word or Excel files. This may not work with other versions. This is version 2016 of Word and Excel, but I believe it might work the same way all the way from version 2010.